I'm Emmy. I'm Papa. Welcome back to the third week of our one month workout program. In the past two weeks, we did full body and belly fat burning, building the abs, swimming the legs, and so this week we'll be focusing on the arms and back. And of course, these exercises will also help you to burn fat all over your body as well. This workout is 10 minutes with 15 exercises, 30 seconds each with 10 seconds rest in between. I would recommend you to do this three to five times this week for the best results. And if you wish, you can also add in the workouts from our previous two weeks. Next week will be the last week of this one month program already. So let's push it, stay committed and focusing on reaching our goals. And if you're ready, let's go. Share your progress and hashtag Emmy family so we can motivate each other to keep going and push harder. First exercise, let's warm up our arms and get our body ready for fat burning with punch jack. Hop your feet in and out. Punch one arm out every time your feet are apart. Alternate between arms. Punch harder, jump higher and faster to burn more fat. Ask yourself if you're giving at least your 70% here. If not, push it more. You want to see results, you have to put in the work. Second exercise is wing fly. An amazing burn to get rid of the arm flap and back fat. Bend your upper body down to almost parallel to the floor, but back with a slight bend in your knees. Arms straight out to the back. Squeeze your shoulder blades together to lift your arms up and down. Again, the faster and the more power in each lift, the more burn you get. No pain, no gain. inchworm with shoulder tap to work our arms as well as our belly core area. Exercise. Bend down to walk your hands forward into high plank until your body is in one straight line. Holding your core tight, tap your opposite shoulder one by one with your hand and walk your hands back to your feet. Work your belly, work your arms, challenge yourself to go faster if it feels easy. is arm plank to take the arms and core burn to the next level. In high plank position, raise one arm off the ground, hold it here while keeping your body in one straight line for 15 seconds before switching sides. 3, 2, 1, switch. The burn in the holding arm is getting intense, I know, it means this works. So keep it up. Fifth, let's work on our back with back squeeze. Exercise. Lying face down with belly on the mat. Reach both arms straight out to the front. Lift your head shoulders and chest off the floor. Then work your upper back and squeeze your shoulder blades together as you bend your arms to the side and back as if you're trying to have your elbows touch behind you. No stopping, keep the burn going. One third of this workout done. Sixth is Commando Jack for an intense cardio plus arm and core burn. Start an elbow plank then push yourself up with one arm followed by the other. Jump your feet apart and back together then lower down to elbow plank. This is targeting not just our arms and shoulders but also our belly as you pull your inner core tight to keep your plank stable. Enjoy the burn, push it even more. Lie face down again for back lift to continue the burn in our back. Exercise. 
fingers behind your head, elbows lifted, then squeeze your back to raise your upper torso up as high as possible. Keep lifting and feeling the burn in your back. Use this time to remind yourself of your goals, how this workout will get you there, and find that motivation to keep pushing. Let's move on to knee push-up for more burn. Hands under your shoulder, knees on the floor, then bend your elbows and lower your body while keeping your back flat and butt down. Elbows tucked close to your body. Once your elbows are at least in 90 degrees angle, push yourself back up. The burn is crazy, but we're not quitters. Keep it up with me, we can do this. We're more than halfway through. Ninth is Mountain Climber. In high plank position, crunch your abs, bring one knee in towards your chest, alternate the side for 30 seconds. Go as fast as possible for the max fat burn. Only a couple more seconds to go, push to your limits to run even faster. That's how we make progress. Good work. 10th, let's get back down to the floor with Superman hold. Exercise. Lying face down, lift both of your arms and legs up so that your body is forming a wide U position. And just hold it here for 30 seconds. We're not coming down. Our hands and feet are not touching the floor until the timer is up. Keep breathing and squeezing your back for the best burn. this workout done. 11. Stand up for push-up burpee. Exercise. Bend down, hands on the floor, jump both feet back, knees on the floor and bend your elbows for a knee push-up here. Then jump your feet in towards your hands and jump up in the air. Clapping overhead. This is not just working the arms, it's a full body cardio burn as well. Go fast, jump high, we're not here to slack. yoga push-up. Sounds chill, but trust me, you're here for the burn, you're going to get the burn. Exercise. Start in upward facing dog position, bend your elbows to push your hip up into an upside down V. Then dive back down to up dog. This is one rep. Your body should be off the floor throughout the whole movement. This is not easy, but if we don't challenge our body, we'll never make progress. Let's get it done. Side plank rotation. Exercise. In high plank, turn to one side as you lift and extend one arm to the ceiling. Look up to your fingers, then rotate back down to high plank and turn to the other side. Hold your abs tight to make sure your hips are not sinking. This trains your arms, cardio, core, and balance. Only two more to go. 14th is air circle. Don't underestimate it. I guarantee you'll feel the burn. Exercise. Arms straight out to the side. Rotate them in circles to the front for the first 15 seconds. Then switch to rotating to the back. Three, two, one, switch. Move your whole arms. Draw bigger and stronger circles. 
Don't slack. How much results you get is totally up to you and how much work you're willing to put in. Rest. And we're finally on to our last exercise, lunch and chop. Let's give it our all. Exercise. Hands together on one side off your shoulder, then take a big step to lunge forward with the opposite leg as you chop with your hands down to the outside of your front leg. Alternate sides, the harder you chop, the more burn you feel in your arms. We're almost there. Last few seconds, chop harder, don't stop. Check out your arms, remember to stretch, repeat this at least 3 to 5 times this week, and feel free to add in the workouts from the previous 2 weeks if you want more burn. Time flies and it's already the 3rd week of our 30 days program, let's push our hardest for the best results by the end of this program. Record your progress and hashtag Emmy family. good work today and I'll see you again very soon.